Hi, it is one thing to hear about something, it is another thing to get to seeing it. Now, last time I did a video about this man called Bartimaeus, and as I said, I don't normally love to refer to him as the blind Bartimaeus, but the scriptures in the book of Mark chapter 9, verses 46 to 52, uh, normally refer to him as the blind Bartimaeus. But when you read verses 52, it tells you that God indeed healed him. This man called Bartimaeus received what he badly wanted from Jesus, the desire to see. Now, when I get to read about that passage of scripture, I tend to believe that Bartimaeus, having been a beggar, he must have heard about Jesus, you know. I mean, the Bible tells us that he was positioned on the roadside. And you and I know that during those, during those times and age, news would spread very fast. So if you were positioned on the roadside, definitely Bartimaeus must have heard that Jesus was healing people. So at this point, Jesus is passing by. And here he was shouting and screaming at the top of his voice, Jesus, son of David, have mercy upon me. I can tell you this, but Myers was convinced within himself that he needed to move just from hearing about Jesus to seeing Jesus himself. When I read the scriptures in the book of Job chapter 42, in verse 5, Job himself comes and says, I used to hear about Jesus, but now I see him. Now, the book of Job is set in a land that was thousands and thousands uh, of miles away from Israel. They were non-Israelites, but at one point in their lives, Job and the rest of his friends had heard about God. But Job comes and he says, I used to hear, but now I see him. And this is what I believe when I look at our lives and your, your, your life and my life. Many times we've heard of what Jesus can do. I tend to believe you've heard of what Jesus has done in the lives of other people. May I also encourage you that hearing is not just enough. You can see. You can experience. You can witness what Jesus is able to do. You can have a first-hand witness of the power of Jesus working in your very own life. And this is why I'm here to encourage you just the same way Jesus brought sight to this man called Bartimaeus, Jesus can bring sight in your life. How I pray that you will get to see Jesus in your life. You will get to see Jesus in your family. You will get to see Jesus in every experience in your life. That indeed I desire to be my testimony. That can be your testimony that will not only be people who are hearing about Jesus in terms of what he has done or what he can do, but we can be men and women who get to see Jesus in terms of what he is doing through his word and through your very own life. God bless you as you appropriate this message in your life.